Investigators are working to learn what made a father shoot and kill his daughter before turning the gun on himself. It happened in Cherokee County right before six o'clock. Fox 5 reporter Eric Perry is outside the home where it happened. Eric, what an unimaginable tragedy for this family. Yeah, Alex, it's really hard to believe here. There are two vans, one carrying the body of a 19 year old woman, the other van carrying the body of her father, who Cherokee County Sheriff's deputies say is also the shooter. Take a look at some of the video we captured from earlier here. Cherokee County Sheriff's deputies got the call to a home here in the Bridge Mill subdivision just before six and found both individuals deceased inside. Officials have released the names of those involved, saying that 57 year old Howard Newhouse shot his 19 year old daughter, Catherine Newhouse, and then he shot himself. The mother was at the home at the time of the incident. Uh, I do not know if she's the one to call 911. Bridge Mill is one of the larger neighborhoods in Cherokee County. Uh, this is not a very, this is not a common type of call we would get here, no. Yeah, all throughout the evening, we've seen neighbors just driving by, many of them mouths dropping, seeing just the sight of police cars here in this neighborhood. Uh, police want to make sure that the community know that there is no threat to the public. They don't believe anyone else is involved here at all. There were some rumors circulating on social media of an active shooter or something like that. That is just simply not the case right now. Investigators are just working to figure out just why and what made this father shoot his daughter and then shot him, killed himself here. That's the latest in Cherokee County. I'm Eric Perry, Fox 5 News.